Let me ask you, are you maybe at or close to retirement? And you might be wondering if there's maybe a better life for you out there somewhere. Somewhere in some country where you can live life on your terms in the pursuit of happiness as this life intended for us in the first place. You're of course on a fixed budget and you're wondering where your dollars will stretch the farthest while at the same time increasing your quality of life. So many countries to choose from, a rather daunting task. Well, if you are possibly looking at relocating to Ukraine, then this video is perfect for you right now. We're going to go through all the pros and the cons to help you with your decision. If this is a serious question on your mind right now, then this is a video you're definitely going to want to watch to the very end right now. Because for a limited time, I'm giving away our $299 full video series that I did with our in-house counsel going over the seven biggest traps that most foreigners fall into when they go it alone trying to relocate to Ukraine. Now there of course is a litany of reasons you might want to leave your country and relocate looking for a better life. The first for most guys is cheaper cost of living. The second reason for most guys where Ukraine is evolved anyway is to find a younger, beautiful woman for love and marriage. And that, guys, is not an easy task. I should know I'm the owner of an international marriage agency. And I can tell you, by far the best advice I can give you is that if you can move to Ukraine and take this process slow, well, you're going to be most likely happiest at the end of the day and make the right decision more inexpensive medical and dental. Medical and dental costs in Ukraine are cheap like borscht, literally. Dental up to a 90% discount over American prices and medical, well, at least 90% cheaper. For example, an MRI is as cheap as 60 bucks for a full body MRI or does that run you 2000 in the US? Possibly even a better climate. Well, if you're from Canada, Minnesota, or maybe Alaska, that is. Five, to reduce your tax liabilities. Six, tax avoidance. Mm, you might be one of those guys that's running from Uncle Sam, but we will save that topic to another day because that is a loaded gun question and you definitely want to get only the best advice from an international tax lawyer in that regard. And seventh, biz ops, business opportunities. Did you know that Ukraine is considered one of the last merging markets in Europe? In fact, did you know the Financial Times awarded two Ukrainian cities, Kyiv and Lviv, among the top 10 smart business locations of the future due to highly skilled yet cheap labor force, especially in some sectors, and at the same time low business overhead, one of the lowest business tax rates in Europe, in fact. So as a result, today's Ukraine is providing an ever increasing list of business opportunities that are rather under discovered. So at the end of the day, why not take the bull by the horns and live life large, live life on your terms. You deserve it, right? Yet I get it. You're afraid of the unknown. You're afraid of the risk factors. Worse yet, the risk factors that you're not even aware of. You are the proverbial fish out of water, not knowing the language, the culture, the legal system. You don't even understand what your risk factors are. So you're literally diving into the deep end when you don't know how to swim. That's what you're doing, relocating to Ukraine on your own with nobody's help. Ask me how I know that. I've lived in Ukraine four years now and believe me, if I could rewind the clock and do it over again, I would seek help. I would have avoided a lot of painful, costly mistakes and you can avoid those by relocating wisely now too. First, you don't really know how to pull the plug, you know, to burn the boat and move to another country and get a temporary residency or residency in that country. Second, you don't speak the language. You don't speak Russian. And there's very little English speaking in Ukraine. So you feel like a proverbial fish out of water. Three, you don't know the laws of the land and that, trust me, can be dangerous. One of my personal favorites, number four, it's my top fear living in Ukraine. You don't know the medical risk factors. You don't know the medical system and worse, 
you don't know where and how to get good medical care. And that is the biggest danger living in Ukraine, uh, 50 plus as far as I'm concerned. Five, you don't know the dental risk factors and you don't know how to choose a good dentist because there are good dentists, but there are many bad dentists in Ukraine as well that you want to avoid. Oh, and let's not forget the banking risks inherent with living in Ukraine and why you don't want to keep large sums of money in Ukraine banks. First of all, their equivalent of the FDIC ensures you own up to $5,000 approximately, okay? I will tell you Ben's story. In 2008, when we had the banking catastrophe around the world, he lost $230,000 when he went into uh, a bank, it was called Platinum Bank in Ukraine, and they invited him upstairs only to tell him, I'm sorry, but we've become insolvent and your $230,000 is gone. And seven biz op risks. Starting your own business in Ukraine, Ooh, caution, 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 caution. I can't stress it enough. There are certain businesses that I think a foreigner can start here and flourish and do very well. There are other businesses that I would avoid like the plague because I've seen foreigners lose their shirt. For example, I have a friend from North Dakota. He invested over a quarter million dollars into farming in Ukraine. It is all gone. That money is down the toilet now. Long story. So you really need to choose your biz ops carefully and your best to get sage wise advice. How about something simple as renting or leasing a property to live in Ukraine? Just a rental agreement, right? Not so easy, not so quickly. Listen to what happened to me. One day I got a call from my landlord. I had a one year lease in place and he said, you have three days to move. I said, well, what do you mean? I have a one year lease in place. He said, you have three days to move. <laughs> I called my ex-Ukraine uh, policeman friend and I said, Sasha, is this true? He can kick me out? He said, unfortunately, yeah. And one of my faves, of course, is how to invest in real estate in Ukraine. Whether you're going to buy your own personal residence, maybe a flat, maybe some land and build, maybe some investment property that you want to fix and resell. Great business, by the way, rental income in Ukraine. Well, be careful. Yes, it's a great opportunity, a great time in Ukraine's historical market cycle to make money in real estate. But like everything, and especially in Ukraine, you have to play it safe and know what you're doing, understand the risk factors, and most importantly, be diligent. Once you understand the risk factors, then you can plan accordingly and you can play it smart. And last but certainly not least, actually I would put this as your number one biggest risk factor in Ukraine, maybe number two. That is, you're moving here, you have no friends, you have no contacts. So what does that really mean? You don't know anyone in Ukraine. Here's what it means in a nutshell. Everything in Ukraine works by who you know. You know the old expression, it's not what you know, it's who you know. That's never been more important in my life than living in Ukraine right here, right now. So for example, you know, you're 50 plus, you wake up one morning and you have heart pains, palpitations, you have some heart issue. And God forbid, what if you need emergency surgery? You don't know who your surgeon's going to be. You don't know his experience. And worse yet, you don't know the conditions of where you're going to have surgery, what equipment and what post-operative conditions you're going to be cared for in. It's a well-known fact that most fatalities in Ukraine are post-operative, okay? When you're in recovery due to very poor hospital conditions. Imagine for a moment if you had access to a VIP trusted Rolodex of professionals. I'm talking doctors, specialists, surgeons, lawyers, accountants, translators, Russian language teachers, bankers, real estate agents, property management, tradespeople, contractors, you name it. Even police and political players in case you somehow get caught between a rock and a hard place in Ukraine. And believe me, it can happen easier than you might think. Let me ask you, what would you pay for such a Rolodex of professionals to make your relocation and your living in Ukraine completely seamless so you can sleep every night with peace of mind knowing that your Rolodex and your power team have it under control for you? Well, I can tell you this. If I had had access to such a power team Rolodex of professionals to help me, 
whew, I would have saved at least 10 grand in painful, stupid mistakes that I made when I first relocated to Ukraine in mostly the first year. Now, when you join our Ukraine Relocation Assistance Program, you won't have to worry about any of those and many, many more challenges inherent to burning the boat and relocating to Ukraine, especially if you don't have any expert help and you just try to go it alone. So if you're like most of our clients, you've decided to relocate to Ukraine in pursuit of a better life, in pursuit of happiness, frankly, in pursuit of a younger, beautiful wife, in which case I promise you our Ukraine Relocation Assistance Program will bring you the peace of mind and reassurance knowing your relocation to Ukraine will go down easily and seamlessly. Now, next step, you're welcome to book your no obligation consultation where we'll go over the entire details of our Ukraine Relocation Program. You can get all your questions answered to your satisfaction. All you need to do is just click on the online calendar link in the description below this video, or alternatively, you're welcome to call, text, or email us at any time. We are here to help you ensure your relocation goes down without a hitch, giving you the complete peace of mind knowing the pros are looking after everything for you. Now, your initial consultation fee is only 100 bucks, but check it out. For a limited time, we're throwing in a video series that I did with our in-house counsel that we call the seven biggest traps that most foreigners fall into when they try to go it alone when relocating to Ukraine and most importantly, how to avoid them. Guys, these videos contain rare content that you'd be hard pressed to find anywhere else. They are invaluable. And for a limited time, you get this completely free with your initial consultation. And to book your initial consultation, you simply click on our online calendar link in the description below this video.